Hey guys and welcome back to the TC Games Daily Origami Series. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make this bow tie. And to make this you're going to need a square sheet of paper. So let's get started and I'll show you how to make it. Okay, so we're going to start with a square sheet of paper and we're going to turn it so that the color side is facing down. Now fold it so that the top edge aligns with the bottom edge so that you're essentially folding it in half. Once you've got that aligned, crease it in. Unfold it. Now fold it so that you end up with a crease running from the edge of this crease here all the way down to this tip. And to do that you grab this tip here and bring it up. And just align it properly before you crease it in. Like that. And then give it a nice crease. So when you unfold it, your crease should run from this point right here all the way down to this tip. Next we're going to fold it so that this edge here comes in aligned with the bottom edge. Once you've got it aligned, start a crease that runs from the crease right here all the way up to some point over here. Just like that. Unfold it should now look like this. Now we're going to fold it up so that we end up with a straight line going through this point right here where the two creases intersect. So go ahead, fold it up to that point there, and then go ahead and just crease it in. Like that. When you unfold it, the crease should run right through the intersection of the two creases. Fold it back. Now we're going to fold it so that this white part here folds right onto the surface. So fold it down like this. And it should be an even fold. Crease it in. Until you end up with this shape over here. Now we're going to take this and we're going to flip it over to the other side. And if you'll notice right over here there's a crease running up this way. And another crease running up this way and they intersect at one point right there. If you can see that. We're going to create a straight crease that runs from that point of intersection of the two creases all the way down to some point over here. So just go ahead, fold it down like this. Crease it in. So as you can see, the crease runs from the two creases touching at the same point all the way down to some point over here. Now we're going to take this edge here so that it comes and intersects with the point right here where the two creases meet. So this is where the diagonal and the straight crease meet. Right there. Once that's aligned, crease it in. Until you end up with this shape here. We're going to do something similar on this side. Except on this side there's just one crease going up to this point here. We're going to create a crease that runs from the end of this crease straight down to some point here. So again, we're going to fold it down, starting at that crease point. Crease it in. Bring it back to the side. We're going to grab this edge and fold it right to the center. So fold it down like this. Crease it in. And you should then end up with a shape that looks more or less like this. Okay, so now we're going to flip this over to the other side. And we're going to fold it so that this edge comes in lines with the center crease. Fold it up like this. Once you've got it aligned, crease it in right at the center there. Once you've creased in the center, what we're going to do now is we're going to take this edge here and we're going to pull it down until it comes down to a point right at this edge here. So it should come down like this. Crease it in. Do the same thing on the side. Grab this edge, pull it down until it comes down to a nice point right at the edge there. Then go ahead and just crease everything into place. Do the same thing on this side, fold it to the center. And then just crease in the middle part. Now grab the edge, start to pull it down until it creates a nice pointed tip down there. Crease it in. Do the same thing here, pull it down. Allow it to create a nice pointed tip. 
piece it into place if you flip it over you should then have your finished bow tie and that's really all there is to it so thanks for watching guys if you like the video don't forget to rate and subscribe and I'll see you next time